So we just did some mobility work and now we're gonna do some squat warm-up. Elas is uh, spending a few days at my place so uh, we're gonna do some workouts together. I gotta do some deadlifts and squats today and Elas got an uh, single on squats RP6 or 7 and then he got some back off work 4x6 RP6. Hamid got to do some uh, singles on deadlifts with 86% I think um, and Jill got some uh, light deadlift work this is Hamid's nephew he doesn't speak English or Dutch he's from Iran so he speaks German so How's your hip feeling? Uh, my hip's fine. Hip's fine? Yeah. Yeah? But uh, my leg? I don't know, man. You don't know? Up, see, what are you going to hit today? I'm gonna do a uh, few singles, five singles with uh, 145 or 150 kg, and then I'm gonna do some deadlifts afterwards and uh, some conventional pause deadlifts as well. So, uh, nice man, stay tuned. Yeah. Easy way.
Another special monster. Another training day with Jill. And the most skinny min 74 kg lifter ever. How do you feel about that being so small? Yeah, we, we don't all just have genetics like you, man. Yeah, I know, man. These are uh, min 66 kg. Supreme yeah, you're genetics. You're massive as fuck. Yeah. I'm just a skinny little bitch. Can't help it. They just felt sorry for you. That's why they let you go to worlds. <laughs> <laughs> With your poverty calves. <laughs> what are calves? What are calves? What are calves? I don't know. How did it feel, man? I feel alright. A little bit tired. A little bit sleep deprived from uh, having Ela sleeping over. Bitch, uh, you slept tw 12 hours straight. Nah, nah, nah. I slept for like two and a half hours. I had to go to work. And then I had another nap for one hour. And then uh, Elias woke me up because he. It's on the other hand, man. What's on the program today? 4x5. 4x5? 7. Jill got a uh, heavy 3x3. Three three. So. Yeah, he's struggling with my belt. He, he can't fit it. Mr. 8 pack can't fit my belt. He's one, um, he's a weight class lower than me. I can fit your belt easy. Yeah, we all saw you struggling. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Elas is over there crying because his workout isn't going as he planned. He's having a rough time. He's all depressed and shit. You can see it in his face. He's just jealous that I ate all the candy yesterday without sharing it with him. That's what this really about, isn't it? I couldn't sleep, man. Couldn't you sleep. Was, you was eating at night. I was eating at night, but you had about eight to ten hours of sleep. Fuck, is that five hours? No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. <laughs> no, you didn't. Fuck you, I did. <laughs> the day before, he said to me like, "Yeah, I always wake up around around ten, and um, I came home around." few minutes past 10 and he was knocked out cold he was just sleeping he, he was so out sad. he was out yeah, I was <laughs> such bullshit <laughs> Me and Jill are now squatting. Elas is already done. We got, I got some um, technique squats, so I got to do some pass squats. And uh, Jill got uh, some heavy squats. Energy levels were really low this workout for all of us. There wasn't a lot of hype. I was kind of sleep deprived. Elias uh, was bitching about the bench all the time. And Jilla actually had a quite good workout. So we're now gonna, gonna go to sleep probably <laughs> and eat some shit. And then we're gonna go on with the day. And this guy is going home today. Yeah, man. Life of a vlogger. 